I'm Nightshade, and that's my mom. Hello, I'm Sophie, and that's my daughter. There's going to be messages for Virgo. All right, let's see what is out there for Virgo today. It First is one. seven of bats. So this is the um, Halloween Tarot. And I'm using the Morgan Greer. Kipling Less, which, y'all, this is a good deck. They don't even print it anymore, so if you can find one, you need to get it. So, Seven of Bats, let's see. This is, ooh, trying to get away with murder. The moon is in Scorpio, mm -hmm. and the sun is in Libra. Yeah, Halloween you're definitely seven. wanting to get away with something. Here's the hangman, yeah. But you're not going to go far. I was going to say, you're about to step in the trap and <laughs> get strung up. Yep. Oh, Virgo. Oh, the Empress. Oh. Wow, well, let's see. Yeah, All I always right. call that my Virgo card, so there you go. All right. The Page of Swords and the Hap. Oh, sorry. The Two of Wands. And the High Priestess. Okay, well, hopefully, Virgo, you're finding out what somebody did to you. You're finding out what somebody else did. Hopefully, you're not on the you're not on the receiving end of too much. It doesn't look too terrible, but you are finding out things that are making you go. Hmm. For a minute there, you were kind of stumped. You're uncovering things that yeah, have you been are. hidden for for a. Uh, a while, not not too long. And it's not anything extremely horrible, but you're kind of heading off, you're heading it off at the pass, which is perfect because now that you have this information, you have a broader view of everything. So you're able to sit like this high priestess here uh -huh. with this cancer energy and go, well, now I know what to do. You've got all, I've got all the facts. Yeah. You've got all the facts. From here, you can make a really good decision, a really good move, a really good plan, a really good whatever. Yeah. Uh, you, you've been at a standstill, which is good. It's allowed, uh, with you're not trying to do anything, it's allowed things to come to the surface. Yeah, exactly. Sometimes no... No movement is exactly what you need. Exactly, Sitting yes. Sitting still is exactly what you need. So that looks like you. So this is somebody else that whatever they did, you're uncovering, you're finding out. Ooh, look, I got the knight, knight of bats, which is the knight of swords. Me, you could clearly see that that's the knight yeah, of swords. Yeah, it's, it's someone close to you. Uh, it's a lover. Uh, I'd say it's a lover, but it could be a brother or sister. Uh, someone really close to you, though, has been doing something behind your back, thinking they've gotten away with it. Mm -hmm. And it, it's not tragic, but it's it's had you wondering what's going on, yeah. why things are moving in yeah. the direction that they're moving. And here, again, is the high priestess in this deck. So, yeah. yeah, you're uncovering it, and you're sitting there just just waiting to use this information. Right now, you can't use it. You're just gathering the information. You're sitting with it. And it's like, it, at the perfect time, though, you're going to be able to strike. At the perfect time. Get all your facts together. Yeah, you need to get everything together and make your little plan about what you're going to do. Hmm. Yeah. There, there's a lot of stuff going on in the background. A lot of things going on happening that you're just just now being privy to, but there's even more. More you've got to find out. You need to know who exactly is doing this. Is it a lover? Is it a brother? Is this, It is someone I close think, to I you. I saw the King of Swords with the Knight of Swords in here, so it is somebody. I'm thinking it's familial. Yeah. So, so. That's sad. You've got true. yourself a situation here. You really do. Uh, and one that if you let it go, it could spiral out of control. Mm -hmm. You can't sit idle forever on this information that you've got. You need to get some more information. Yes, you're waiting, but you can't wait forever. At some point, you've got to step forward. Mm -hmm. You've got to step forward. And you're just getting getting yourself ready for that. Yeah, so, look, there's the tower. That's, what it, that's what's going to happen. Yeah. Look, there's the eight of... 
this is the imps in this deck, but it's like eight of wands. When you bring that tower down, yeah, it's gonna be in a hurry, all of this stuff. Once it, and then it'll be a culmination. That'll be it. It'll be, there's your three of cups, three ghosts. Look For at some of you, I'm being told this is your mother. Oh. This is your mother for some of you. For others, it's going to be someone else. That makes sense with these two right there because she's your mother card. That's Virgo, but she is the mother card of the deck. Yeah. She is the mother, like the Queen of Pentacles is the mom too because she's such the earth mother. All Aww. right. Well, you're on to it. You're on to what's that there is something going on in the background, something that you need to uh, get more facts about. You need to uh, run it through your mind. You need to decide what you're going to do. Yeah, you really need to formulate a plan with that two of wands. Yeah. You need to take this big, broad look at everything from that higher vantage point. That's what the two of wands is. Remember, he's standing way up there, and he's looking out. He's got the globe in his hands. He's 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 very fortunate in the fact that he's got that real high upper ground place that he can look out over his entire kingdom. Um, and I'm sure that me that word kingdom means something to somebody. Just throwing that at him out in, on the table. If if there is a kingdom that you're trying to protect. Like she said, you're not going to be able to sit on this information forever. You're going to have to use this information and make a move because the, you've got some stuff to protect. This two of wands is really standing out. Like you're really looking. You're really standing there looking. Yes. Especially because it's both of these right here with this hangman. And for really some of you who looking. are hesitant to move forward with what you know and what's being done, uh, like we said, you... You can't just sit idle. No. But you... It's coming. It's you coming You need down. to... Uh, you know, you're being done wrong. Yeah. And it doesn't matter who's doing it. It's... You're being done wrong. Mm -hmm. And you may not want to confront this person if it is a mother figure. Mm, that's tough. But that you're going to have to. So... Because there could be a lot of guilt associated with that. Yeah. So, if you want some further help uh, with this, if this resonates with you... Mm -hmm. Um, shoot us an email, we'll uh, work with you, we'll mm -hmm. throw the cards, we'll, you know, see if there's some type of meditation you need to do or a spell to protect yourself or a spell to, uh, you know, you might just need a, a spell of, uh, of uh, what, what I want to call it, a... I'm looking at this since this is such the tower with the high priestess energy. If I was looking Strength. at a spell, yeah, it would be like a fortifying spell. Yes, because, because you're you already don't want here. To, you don't want to do this. You're already on the upper ground. So this is something that's like you just need to fortify and protect yourself. Yeah. Because once you, you let loose these little imps, I think. It seems like the damage is done. You know, all you want to do is protect yourself from whatever this person yeah. has in store for you. But the da this person is damaged, and the damage they did, it's you're you're already trying to head it off at the pass anyway. You know, so let's, too late for that. Too late for that. So shoot us an email, and we'll see if we can help yeah, you. Yeah, just depends in on where way. you are in this situation. If you need to know more about the situation, yeah. or if you're wanting to. Uh, work something out so we wish you the best virgo we really yeah. do this is a tough situation yeah, especially, especially if you're if dealing a with a family mom. member a mom if it's a mom and daughter situation so all right shoot us an email if uh, this resonates with you and we'll see what we can do for you so until our next read may your moons always be full Bye bye bye